the resignation. A new study shows that people just can't live on Michigan's minimum wage, which is $7.40. Families need more than three times that to be financially secure, and a single adult with no kids needs more than $12 an hour to live comfortably. Turning to sports, break out the brooms. The Tigers sweep the Minnesota Twins, and, on a, and they're on a four-game winning streak. Too. Well, it's official. Tom Gores is the new owner of the Detroit Pistons. The sale of Palace Sports and Entertainment and the Pistons to Gores was formally completed Wednesday. Gores now becomes the fourth owner in the franchise's history. And finally, Kid Rock has everyone anticipating a big announcement today. He hasn't given any details, but on Twitter he said he would be spending more time at Comerica Park this summer and he wouldn't just be watching the Tigers play. So many believe he's going to announce plans for a summer concert. We'll keep you updated on this big announcement. Now, Lori, I went on his website to mm -hmm. see the tour dates. He has one weekend in August that is free. So maybe that's the weekend. Plus, a lot of his concerts have Sheryl Crow with him. Oh, I like Sheryl Crow. I, alone, I mean, I don't know. Get something that looks a little nicer. Change the colors. I'll put my thinking cap on. Yeah. Last mornings, it is 627. Officials in Massachusetts are assessing the damage this morning following a rare string of tornadoes. At least four people are dead and dozens injured. But officials warn that toll could rise. Manuel Gallegos has the latest from Springfield, Massachusetts.